Oh dear, I'm sure the kids are okay. I know how you're feeling, but moping around ain't gonna help a thing. Woo! Well, that mother tried. I know what I said, but I don't think I'd be feeling any different if I was her. We're getting nowhere fast, we never reach the kids this rate. See it up there? There's no entrance to the mines. But we can't reach it anymore. If only that fellow uh, Mario were here, he could reach that in a heartbeat. Well, speak of the devil. I am no devil. Well, I'd be a Goomba's uncle. It ain't him in the flesh. Mario, you're a lifesaver. All right, have you heard the news? Sure have. Mario, will you help us break him? Of course. Thanks, Mario. Now here's the entrance up there. Here, hop onto our shoulders. And now we jump on them and booyah. Let's go. This place is going to have a rough time for most of the characters here. Especially our new uh, new enemy types, the Bob Bombs and the Cluster. These guys are annoying. These have huge magic attacks. And the Magmites are heavy defensive guys. <coughs> I'm going after the magic guy first because might as well. Oh, I forgot my timing on that one. There we go. There's the timing for the symbols on that. Oh man, these guys hit like a truck. Good thing I blocked that. But see, they're all physically defensive. It means you gotta use magic attacks on these guys in order to actually hurt them. Well, at least the guy who has higher defenses. The guy is basically defensive heavy. Geo beam to you. Gonna go hold down power. There you go. That takes care of them. Luckily, they don't have much health, so they can just go down with easy. But these have higher defenses! Woo! Use the fire box to fill my mushrooms up. Get a mushroom on Mario. Mushroom on Mallow. And a mushroom on Gino, so we're all healed up. Before we get hit by a flaming... Oh, that guy disappeared. Alright, no worries. Now, these guys, these little magnemites, they don't have much health. They're just... Uh... Oh, we got a Lucky! This is where the, actually I gotta find out where the luckies start from time from time to time. The lucky stuff happens. Well, luckies are basically mini games. If you can double your coins or your XP, if you lose the game, you uh, don't gain anything. You just have to find the Yoshi. He's in the middle and he's on the right side. There you go. Simple little game, and if you you can basically win this most often than not, and you get more experience points to boot on this. You fire flower, you fire bomb. There we go. Take care of the fire guy. There we go. There's the timing for that. For the uh, for the Mighty Glove. The symbols. Now, my first playthrough of this in the remake, I actually kind of forgot about the froggy stick for Mallow. So I was still uh, so he was still unarmed up until this point before I got the symbols for him. It was kind of embarrassing, to be perfectly honest, because he couldn't do much. Ooh. It's a Bob Bomb and another Magnemite. And Lucky. See, I'm getting like Lucky. There are times where you can get like like three or four different lucky props all at once. And it's like, you only get one minigame out of it. So it's like, you get more lucky, so you're like, oh, that's not, that's not, this is worthless, you know? Double my coins again? Heck yeah, I'll take it. I'll need all the money I can get. And it looks like he's in the center. And he is! Haha, <laughs> Yoshi has found it. If you get a tie, you don't get, you don't get any more bonuses, but you still keep your coins. If you lose, you lose everything, just as usual. Um... Lava bubble, huh? That's a special enemy. Special power away! Oh, I don't know, he's resisting the magic. Hot spot. Ooh, it missed. Booyah! Mallow, I don't think you do anything to the lava bubbles, but I'll give it a try. 160. Oh, wow, you did a lot of damage, actually. Yeah, the symbols are actually... Oh, oh, now it's actually a harmful attack. <laughs> I did, um, I did a short on this a little while back, uh, my first playthrough of this, where I did, uh, Mallow's, um, thoughtful, thoughtful thought of this thing on a ball bomb, and it said, oh, I'm gonna, if I explode, it's gonna hurt, you know, and then, there's a rare item in the in the mines. If I find it, I'm gonna sell them to someone toward for the money. Someone's just trying to use it for money for exploding purposes. Now, what's this way? Nothing. It's blocked. 
But I, I was like, there's a bob on that said like, oh yeah, I'm gonna basically, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna explode. It's gonna hurt. And then he did an explosion attack on us and, and it did, and it missed <laughs> on Mallow. So I was like, yeah, the, the attack didn't work. <laughs> uh, let's jump on this. I don't know why Mario would want to jump on this, but it knocks him out. And unfortunately, this is where our coins get stolen by none other than the madman himself, Croco. Coins, beautiful coins, grab the coins. Listen up, we leave this, this half-wit Mario here and split. Anyone got a beef with that? Let's go. Hey, give me back my coins, you. Get back here. All right, Croco's guys again. He took our coins, too. Let's chase him down and get him back. So we got a little subplot here with this guy. Now, Croco is actually walking around really, really fast after all this is done here. You have to, have, you actually have to go and attack and race it to win this day again. Oh boy, it looks like it's in here, but not to worry. Hey, <laughs> I've got a bomb. Never leave one without him. Get a bomb right there. You know, Mario could have stopped him right there and then, but you know, he let cutscene powers take effect. Get back here, you! Oh, dang it. Fine, you're getting, you're getting my way, but I like I like the level ups though. Up, oh, another lucky. Another lucky for days. That's all we get now, luckies. Oh yeah. At least now I'm glad that Mal is finally pulling his weight in terms of attack power. Double XP, yes please. Oh, I think he's on left. Yes, he's on left. Woo, that was close. Kind of lost him there for a split second. <laughs> We gotta get back and get that croco, get our money back. Oh boy. And get back to you! You need to rush after him. He is running around in the entire map here. Um, so if you, you can wait for him to show up or just try to be get lucky to find him around. Just because it's how he is. That's how you're gonna be able to progress this thing. Because you need a bomb from him just to continue on with the mission. Here we go. And then it's the law bubble special defense up. Nice. Here we go. Okay, not too much there. And that guy takes down. And another lucky. You see, I'm getting like multiple luckies at once. But it's funny that we don't get luckies until this point. So it's like a lucky is only available when you have a full party. I guess that's the case, but still. He's in center. Right, yo! We get double experience points! And that allows Mario to level up once again! I will give his physical up because Mario does better in physical damages. There's one guy here. There's these crooks. These guys are usually quick on their feet and they'll basically flee when they get the chance. So when you get the upper hand on them, just tack them fast. Don't set up anything up. Just tack him now. Because he's usually dropped more coins. And Mallow levels up again! And Mallow, you're going to get your... Since your physical needs to be going up a little bit here and get your physical defense up, let's do that. So, so, just you wait. We'll get you this. We got you this time. Maybe not today, Mallow, but someday. He didn't have the coins on him, but he dropped a flower tab. Cool. Oh, Enigma. Our new enemy type. These guys basically are just like lots of, like... Cats all together in one f in one space, and basically try to harm you in different forms. That takes care of them. That takes care of the bubble bubble. But now take the enigma. This guy is annoying to fight when he becomes a special enemy type. He's annoying, very much so. Getting our frog coin for our trouble on that one. I gotta find those more crooks. There's another one. And I got five of these bad boys. Oh, I missed. How did I miss? There we go. Got one. And they all start running, though. Ow! Well, at least we kill one. We just kill two of them. Oh, dang it. How do I keep missing? I don't have any uh, debuffs on me that I can miss. Oh, well. Got a honey syrup that puts in the box. So, so, just you wait, we'll get you this. Maybe not, we'll get you for this. Well, maybe not today, but tomorrow, but someday. You have the coins on, but you dropped the flower tab. It's good to go after these uh, crooks because they all actually have flower tabs on them. 
All right, flower tab, what you got for us? There we go. And these guys drop a lot of coins if you defeat them, so yeah, it's wor much worth your time to try to attack these guys. Thunderbolt them death. There we go. Booyah! They have no, they have no health, so that's okay on that my part. Fifty coins, man. That is, that is a steal of a drop. And the dance but someday, you didn't have any coins on me. Drop the flower tab. And there we go. Flower tabs. We get our at least one point up everywhere. Our flower points are going up pronto. But now we've taken care of the crooks. That means, that means. Uh, oh, dang it! I didn't see him in the rock there. He just popped out of nowhere. These crystallized guys, they are annoying to f uh, to have them attack. Once they start attacking, they'll do a magic damage to you, which is probably low on your uh, low to totem pole of what you're fixing up yourself to be. And they're lucky! Goodness me! Wow. Alright. There we go. Take him down. Boom! No, double XP? Yes, please! Come on, I need the XP bonus. He's on the right. Oh, I hit the wrong one! No! I don't get anything! Dang it, I hit it too much. That's what happens when you mess up. Again, the button's really sensitive. I had it right, and I messed up on it. Ah! The bob -bombs are not attacking us, because they're gonna die. And they fall over dead. Coins a buddy. Alright, now where is this creep at? I see Rocco or uh, Croco is running around everywhere. You just have to be lucky at the one point he's coming backward towards you and just attack him. And he will try to turn to run tide, so. I hope I can find this guy. He's running around a little unfairly here. Oh boy, nope. Oh, there he is. Got it! Oh, dang it! I hit the wrong one! You guys are in the way! I was gonna attack Croco! How dare you! And they're all lucky. Let's see, we just get luckies for days in this cave here. So this is actually the best cave to get luckies in, I guess? Eh, uh, not to die. I got, I got Croco to save. No! Get back here, you! I could have had you! Oh! Well, I'll get the experience anyway by default. The fence up! Booyah! Come on, you bob -omb. I was going after the croc guy and somehow I messed up. How did I not die? There you go. Bomb's dead. Croco? Oh, we got level up. Gino is leveling up this time. And I got Gino boost. Attack up, press A before the end for a defense up too. Uh, we'll get his physical attack up this time around for a second level up. And now I gotta catch him up again. He ran away. Ah, Croc ran off. So hopefully he's gonna come back around here again and we'll just basically attack him when he runs into us again. Hopefully he'll run in here and we'll just tackle him when he gets here. Hopefully. There we go. Alright, Croc. Croco, round two. And what not better way to do it than Star Raiders on this guy? Right off the bat. I want my coins back, dang it. Then we get to play here the good music of slightly stronger enemy. 230 damage on him. And suck him bop him! And the symbols on him. Symbols on he's a really kind of physical defensive here. He will steal stuff from ya. I am someone I use them on himself. You want them back? You gotta take me down first. <laughs> Monster toss. Ow. All right, Gino Boost, you're going on Mario right now. There we go. Attack up and a defense up for Mario. Boom! 120 damage right there from the start. Come on, you Croco. You can't do much to us anymore. Monster toss. Fine. Gino Boost is going to Geo Boost himself. There we go. Attack up and defense up, baby. Heck yeah. 
Now the defense, now these things actually stay up for this buff stays around for the entire match until the level, until the thing's over, unless, or unless you die. What has he got in that bag, man? Yo, it up already. Here's your junk. Yeah. I'm out of here. And that's it for Croco. For now, anyway. And a flower box. Ah, ooh, ooh. Not bad. Got your coins back in and picked up a micro bomb, too. What do we use that for? Anyway, let's go up this way. Now we can use that bomb to basically to uh, do some damage here. Hey, buddy. See so you found something useful. My kids died in my yard, trapped back there. Let's blast through and find them. Yo, thanks, Mario. Here, take this micro bomb. There we go. Let's follow these tracks to the end. What? The star is probably in the back. Let's mosey on along now. No, you let me take it. Oh, you guess you're right. I should be a bird on you, fellas. Well then, I'm counting to find my kids here. Thanks a lot, Mario. I guess I'll be going back to mom about everything. And the mole man is going home. Now we're in the second half of the dungeon here. And this is kind of uniqueness here. We have two paths to take. One has bombs on it. The other has nothing. But the top berry has... Starman! We can just run into enemies here. Get ourselves some experience points. Who you come on, level up, up? Oh, I didn't level up any of that. But I did get some experience points from doing that, though. There we go. Boom, ya! Take you out! Two experience points to boot! Give me my coins back from the coin box here. Boom, ba, boom, ba, boom. Anything over here? They're usually something above a box somewhere. And we got bombs. Bombs for days. Goodness. Now refresh. We'll save. Override that one. There we go. And now we attack. Ooh, there's a, a flower tab for us. Fire box, so put the fire box on, and that's about it. And we got ourselves another boss. Oh, but we also have normal enemies to attack on first. <laughs> they ran into us first. Defense up. Okay, got him. But man, I'll tell you, uh, when you find the harder version of these enemies, and basically later on in the game, these things, the, those clusters, they will, they'll hurt like a truck. They will. Hey, you! How dare you! Oh, ow! I think you have to get it from the side or something or let the bomb explode on him. Oh, I gotta take all of his enemies out. Alright, fine. We'll take his enemies out to make him nicer. Bam! Alright, we're gonna take this is the next. This is it's kind of weird how what this enemy is. Like, this enemy that's throwing bombs around, I don't think he's actually part of Smithy's gang. Like, he doesn't act like he's part of Smithy's gang. He feels like he's just like a random person that was just inside the mines here at one point. It's just so weird to me. HP to the max, thank you. Oh man, this cluster is very powerful. Ow. At least when he gets into his magic attack, that's when it's most deadly. Boom. And another pick-me-up. Thanks, I need that. All right, I'll take out your bomb fellows out here. Damn, we'll, oh, the clusters are special. Oh, that's not good. Ow. <laughs> Boom ya! Kill those bombs. Bomb didn't die. Oh, no! Okay, now that's a hurtful explosion. Ow. Come on, now, you. I guess they want to add these special enemies to make, you know, you know, random fights a little bit harder at times. I guess that is, that's fine and dandy enough, because this game can be borderline easy to the point of basically be of a... As long as you know how to time everything right, you basically couldn't have an... As long as you can block any attack that's not blockable, you basically don't have to worry about much of anything, really. The pick are being poured in storage boxes. No! Why don't you like me, man? Come on now! I took out your friends. 
Come on now, you. There we go. I have to walk from the back, hein, here. This is. Good day. The name is Punchinello, bomb maker extraordinaire. Punchello, never heard of you. You can also try to put a James Bond impression on him beforehand. No, you will make me famous. So long. So Punchello, all right. First off, Geno Boost Mario. There we go. Got the fence up. Mario's going to do a punch. Punchello doesn't like being punched. All right. Uh, let's see about his thought peak. See what we got for him. 1,030 health, and he has no weaknesses. But he also will spawn mini bombs on us. So, what I would do for those is that let uh, let Mallow take care of the bombs with electrical, and just focus on on everyone else to do uh, Punchello. So boost up on here, tack up, and defense up, baby. Boom ya! Do a thunderbolt on everyone, so it takes out the bombs too. Ooh, yeah. That means he has to waste a turn basically spawning new bombs. Means he won't have a chance to attack. And let's Gino beam this to death! 156 damage. And that goes his first phase down. Not bad, not bad. Now the level now the level of things up. Now he summons bigger bombs. Normal bombs with that. Alright. Uh do Punchello? Uh, there's the Thunderbolt on everyone. I don't take everyone down, though. But I think we can get away with the, uh, Geno Beam on him. As long as we focus on, uh, Punchello, the base of the boss fight, it's gonna continue on through the match. You really don't have to worry about the bombs all that much. See, like that? Booyah! Alright, you asked for it! I bring the Mega Bombs! Mezzo Bombs are now upon us now. How about we you And also, we can't attack uh, Punch Out until we take the bombs out. So... Oh, I know we can't attack him. There we go. Sandstorm, that's an unblockable attack. That puts fear on us, which basically lowers our attack power. And that basically ruins all of our... Uh... Alright. Uh, what we need to do is... Uh... <laughs> Another Geno boost on Mario because now we're fearful. Attack boost up. Defense up again. That's still gonna make him fearful. I see now it does less attack on him. Uh, Thunderbolt. Ooh, yeah. Now Bone Child's not gonna do attack now. Find it long last. Ooh, that's the problem. Uh. I didn't think that was actually going to do that much damage to Mallow. Thank you! Mario, you need an item before you basically attack anything. Medium Mushroom to make you fully healed. Got a freebie out of it, too. There we go. Ah, there we go. At least I can do the small boost on here. Geo Beam on the Punchello! We're gonna make sure you pay for what you've done, Punchello! Even though he's really not basically the behind the attacks that's happening. He's just down here throwing bombs everywhere. He also has a smiley face emote on his front. Arrgh! I must be dreaming! I'm ruined! I didn't want to do this, but now I have no choice! I think he's bluffing! Simmer down, Fluffy! I'm gonna waste this on you. Who knows what might happen? Take your best shot. Yes! Enough, I got my pride. Now you're in for it. What? What the hey? Why isn't it working? Ooh! Well, he got killed by his own bomb. Mario! What does it take to our history? This is a fine mess. Let's scram now! Yes! Oh. Eep! It's gonna blow! No! Oh, 
Also, it's a harm harmless explosion. What on earth was that? Well, we won the battle. Now I hope we don't lose the war. Where are Diana and me and the star? Oh, there's a star. I guess that's part of that's been answered. <laughs> Come on, Mario, hurry! You got it! And we collect our next star. Yeah, that's actually pretty quick to gain the next star here. It's almost like this is kind of a short, like a short chapter in that regard. But our third star piece, man. Yeah, we go through getting these star pieces like really quickly until like to like the fifth one. And then it's like it takes forever to get the sixth one. And the seventh one is basically the end of the game. So it's like <laughs> we're getting through these stars like really fast. And that's our third star. Heck yeah.